YouTube back again. So guess what I'm doing today? We outside in a heavy storm today. Um, 99% chance of rain, but not even a chance. 99% rain today, which is a wash, but that's not gonna stop the crime. So as y'all know, we still on the hunt for a tow truck. So we about to actually go back I kind of like went off the checklist. So um, this is checklist time. So, you know, I went to all the different spots I maybe have to go to, which you maybe ain't see everything. So now I'm revisiting the checklist of number ones, number two, number three, you know, spots I want to go to. So we all be on our way back to Jersey again to check out a tow truck. And, you know, try to work a deal out. You know what I mean? Maybe do a test drive. So, I want y'all, I just wanted to bring y'all with me today. You know what I mean? Today is, oh, it's a gloomy day. Today is real gloomy and real, you know, it's like body draining, like, you know. So, but, you know, I got up. As I said, the grind don't stop. Gotta do what I gotta do. Can't make no excuses. Because if I make excuses, nothing gonna get done. And that's gonna bring me back. That's not, and, and I'm not gonna elevate. So, look at the weather. I'm out here. You know what I mean? Don't gotta work today, so I'm out here. So, as I said, um, we, we're heading to Jersey. We're like an hour and 10 minutes away. I know, like, he's looking at my face like, yeah, I know. But, you know, we gotta do what we gotta do. So just stay with us, you know what I mean? Look at the weather, like it's really crazy out here. You know what I mean? But as long as there's no traffic, you know what I mean? It's all good. Let's get out this lane, just like how the other As long as there's really no traffic and there's, and there's a flow, you know what I'm saying? I'm all good with it, like, you know what I'm saying? They ain't gonna stop me, so. All right, man, we gonna check back on, check back with y'all guys, you know what I mean? When we kind of like, a quarter, a quarter through our drive, you know what I mean? Because it look like we gotta be, we gotta go through Harlem and a bunch of different highways and all that. So, you know what I mean? We gotta maneuver, you know what I mean? We trying to stay safe, trying to stay blessed, trying to stay consistent, as always. And that's what we doing. So, stay tuned with us. We be back in a minute. All right, so we back. We on the, the, the George Washington. We going and do it right now. The lower level. So, it look kind of, as I said, you see the weather's crazy. It's crazy. I just came out through the um, Harlem River Drive and it was like, it was like a river. That's crazy. I should have showed y'all the footage on that, but it's all crazy. So, we're 51 minutes down. Slight traffic. But um, it was a quick flow though, you know what I mean? It's not like an ordinary day where, you know, traffic is all, um, it's still traffic, but it's not like it's crazy, so. It's flooded all over the place, man. I got floods, and you know my car is low. My car don't like this. All this flooding. So I guess that the flooding just held up the traffic. So I guess we're supposed to be flowing right now. Yeah, so hopefully, you know what I mean? Um, hopefully we have a blessed day. Let me see if I can give y'all a little bit more light because it's like dark in here under the tunnel. So we just gave y'all some light before we go back into the light. And we about to actually go back into the light, so I'm gonna turn on my light. So yeah, um, just want to have a blessed day, you know what I mean? And hopefully everything work out to my advantage because as I said, it's time, you know what I mean? I work very hard. And I'm working hard on this channel, trying to stay consistent with y'all, you know what I mean? I'm trying to motivate y'all. And, um, and, and that's what it is. I'll, you know what I'm saying? I want to tell a funny story. I met a gentleman at work. Right, he's um he's older than me. He's like in his fifties and all that. So um he has a old school, he has a Buick Regal and he's not even motivated with the car. He had it, he had it for a few years and all that. Right. And um he don't even take it out and he don't even do nothing with it. So, you know, I try to show him a little bit of motivation, you know what I mean, this week and let him know that, you know, I do the same thing you do, you know what I mean? And maybe I, you know, I was telling him, maybe I could motivate him to take his car out and, you know, just start it up or something. Because, you know, a lot of people have old school, but they just don't have that, that motivation, you know what I mean? For somebody to motivate them, for somebody to put them in. Point them in the direction, man. Look at all this, man. Look at them things, man. Look at them. Nah, it's just in the ways, man. It's like going from that way, like, like it is crazy. Getting a good car wash, though. You see how the wind, the white is just going, like, the wind is going that way. 
But yeah, back to my um, back to my story. So yeah, like so, it just you know the pictures and the little videos I showed them kind of motivated him. He was like, yo, like you not playing, like you know what I mean. You do what you do, right? You do what you're doing. You're not you're not playing with it, like you know what I mean. You're starting up your car, you're taking it outside, you're going around the block. I see you trying to do shows and all that. So as I said. You know what I mean? This is not, this channel is basically for motivation. It's a motivate you if you gotta build or you're trying to build or you're trying to get something. You know what I mean? I'm here to motivate you as well as, you know, other people motivate me. So I'm just, you know what I mean? Just doing the same. Like, that's basically what I'm doing. I'm just showing you an incredible build. I'm showing you what we doing. You know what I mean? I'm showing you progress. I'm showing you elevation. So yeah, like, you know, I really, you know, I felt good. I was able to like really meet somebody and like actually like motivate them. And to like, you know, get in their car back on the road and, you know what I mean, cleaning it up. And I'm just telling him about different products and different mods he could do and all that, you know what I mean? So, just trying to like, just make sure I jump on the right road, like. See the weather, it's crazy, man. It's crazy. So we gonna get back to y'all in a minute, man. After we, you know, we just hit Jersey after we actually get it together. All right, stay tuned. All right, traffic was going so well, man. I was flowing, and then look what we got here. What that say? Crash, man. Somebody done, done fell asleep, or somebody did some. But the roads was kind of like, it was kind of bad because I was flowing, I was doing like 60 and I really don't do 60 in this car. But um, just because of all the puddles and all that, and somebody maybe fell down in that. And this is, I'm over here by the Delaware Water Gap. So somebody maybe done slid down in that, in that ditch right there. If you start down there, man, you ain't getting back out. Depending on what you um, you driving, but I guess it looked like it got scooped up though. I guess they scooped them up because I see the tow truck where it had. I know y'all can't see that, but it looked like the tow truck scooped them up and got them out of here, which is good. In the nick of time, because we got 28. Y'all see that? 28 minutes in to go. But let's see what's going on over here. That's the sign. I'm gonna pass. Let me see what's going on here. Police. Cut. Maybe somebody broke down, maybe an accident or something. Something, something. Something, I see tow trucks on this side. And what happened? I can't tell you what happened. The way he said crash, but I don't know what happened. I really don't know what happened. I really don't care, because we back on that flow again. We got the ambulance over here. On the other side coming, man, there's always something, something, but I'm back on the flow, I'm back on the grind! Be back at it again, man. I gotta get out of here before it gets dark, because if it's dark like this, oh, God, woo! It's gonna be a journey down home, man. But it's 
traffic still is, the traffic is still built up, man. It's saying something about another crash, man. But what's good, people? Let me get this little bit of rain, man. Chill. Coming, slowing down. Y'all was going. When I tell you, it was the best I ever been on this highway flowing. I was blowing. You know what I mean? I was killing time. I was like, yeah. But, I don't know. Now we got this traffic. I need a, um, you know, this thing, this way he's got this thing that said report ahead. Let's see what it says. It says heavy traffic jam, 0.2 miles. Left lane block. Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, but once again, if you're new to my channel, my name is Life of Mike LS. We um we um tow truck hunting. You know what I mean? Oh, they go a tire hole. They go a hole. I like that color though, that's a dope ass brown. But yeah. We on that. That hunt for that tow truck. We about to pull up on and um, take a look on this rainy day. Cause I'm off today, so I have no choice, people. I have no choice. I wish I did, but I don't. I have no choice. Gotta do what I gotta do if I ain't do it today. It wouldn't happen at all. So we're gonna never tell. We got the Chessy in front of me. Seeing that we kind of was like bugging in the rain because you know them joints is all wheel drive versus the rear wheel drive. So you know, he's not sliding, he's not doing nothing. So I want to know what's up with this traffic. All right, yeah, all right, that pop up again. But where is that? Oh, I see it. Is it? Oh, it's on the other side. Thank God it's on the other side. But by the time I'm getting ready to get out of here, I hope it's clear. Do not want to deal with that. So just because it's on the other side, everybody knows he's on my side looking at it. So that's why I got the traffic. Hopefully ain't nothing serious. But this side is a dangerous side because you got that, that dip. You run up in that with a railroad drive, you ass out. You need a four by four to get out of that. Or a Tessie. Yeah, it's on my side. Oh boy, oh boy, what happened now? What happened now? I don't know if y'all can hear me. I see all the lights and all that. Got the help me truck out there. So it look like I'm gonna have to um it look like I'm gonna have to get out that um this lane. I'm gonna have to get out this lane real quick. Cause everything is actually in the left lane as the ways they say. Let's see if we can get you that good footage of what happened. Everybody just blowing on the side. What happened? What happened? I think a tow truck, you know, a tow truck again. I got Mike LS News on the highway, live and direct on I-80. I-80, we reporting traffic. Reporting traffic on I-80. Look in the back, look at the traffic in the back. All right, so, all right, here we go. Well, my senses is kicking off emergency vehicle crash. Okay, okay, we see ya. We see ya, what happened? What happened here? What you think, Nas Motion? What happened, Nas Motion? I ain't no more. They go to uh, New Jersey Safety Service Patrol. Go ahead, man, you got it, you got it, homie. Go ahead, you got it. We let you go. Let you go. Make sure this person let me go. Alright, so let's see what happened here. Let's see what happened here. So we got the safety patrol. We got the ops. And we 
got a smart car that ran into the dirt, lost control, and went into the water gap. Like I said, yeah, like I said, he went down in there. He was solo dolo. You know what I mean? He maybe was smoking a blunt with some Bacardi Gold, lost control, and went down in a hole, and the smart car couldn't get out. But yeah, we 25 minutes away, so I'm gonna hit y'all back when we like 10 minutes away because we back in motion. We back in motion, slight delay, slight, oh man, what's going on here again, man? My joint just went off, so something else happened? Uh-oh, uh-oh, it's one of those days today, let me play my screen, uh-oh, what's going on? What's going on? So we just got off the highway. It looks like something happened out here. I seen a dude jump out his car. Maybe mac up and hit somebody or something. Something happened. I don't know. They slow the traffic down. I don't know. We all see. Oh, there we go. What happened? Something maybe for all oh, stuff flew out his truck. That's what happened. Terrier flew out his truck with the windy, windy city. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You ain't nothing have a box flew out for his stuff. Oh. So he macked up or something. I seen him jump out like a madman, like. But give y'all some more light. Woo! Uh we eight minutes in, baby. So we had we had good flow, good flow. Like even though the weather was bad, it was a it's it's a good flow. It was a flow through the rain. The only hiccup was um that little minor accident, but oh, um, we in, what the hell road is this? SR15N. So, no, we almost there, we almost there. We made good timing, you know what I mean? I'm happy I decided to take this trip. Last time I took the trip, I did it like, it was like rush hour, wrong time of the day. It was crazy. I think it was um, it was on a Monday. What holiday? I think it was President's Day we did that. Thinking nobody's gonna be outside, but everybody was outside coming to Jersey. So actually today was just, you know, the weather's bad, but we got a flow. So we keep the flow. We just gonna breeze through this in an hour, hour in, hour out. All right? Let me get out the way. It's hard. So, so. Now it's time to find our destination. Let's see if we find our destination. What we do? We get, get a test drive in the rain. I guess that's the best time to do shit when the weather's like messed up. Like, to see how you know everything's going to perform and work out. So, gas prices out here. High. Gas prices are going to go down to the gas in this area. This must be a bougie area. Wow. I'm going to find all this. So we're almost there. Five minutes, six minutes down. Back in the countryside. Now it's a dive motion. Remember this sign? Remember this? I don't remember right. You can't do that. The hell, I'm not here. Look at the Look at them light posters. Sheesh! Electricity, that's how down south and all them places is. You know, New York City ain't like that. We don't got these things out there. That's some real deal electric. Whoa, 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 what are you trying to do, homie? You trying to make me mac up? You trying to make me mac up, man. That's... No, no, no. Alright, so looking at the Abbey. Be 
be square. I know they maybe thought I wasn't coming to the hill, but I just got to come in this way. But I am motivated and I'm consistent, people. So, hey, uh, listen, get an umbrella. Rain ain't gonna stop me. Snow not gonna stop me. Get an umbrella, because I'm out here grinding. It's grind time. March is almost over till the 23rd. So, before I blink my eye, we in April. May, June. But May, go time. Point blank. April just to button everything up. Get all your, your nuts and bolts and get everything into alignment. May is go time. If you ain't ready by May, hey, might as well you forget about the summer. Real talk. Real talk. We go time right now, so. What, what, what is that? Everybody flying past me with my car slow. That's crazy. Maybe hit that track mode on your ass. Play around with it. What's wrong with them? Huh? What's wrong with them now? You know what I'm driving? They go that big American flag. Salute to America. Nah, sing the national anthem. Oh, say, I say sing the national anthem. They don't ever know that, right? They don't ever do that in school no more. I remember they used to do that in school. Um, they used to do that um, every time the, um, the class start. They used to have to say the national anthem. They put it on the, on the speakerphone. That's crazy. They don't do that now no more, right? That's crazy. We had to sit there and go like this. And I'm like... That's crazy how time change, people. Oh, wait a minute. I actually got the arm styled over because I got to turn down. Edison. What is this Edison have? Edison Road. Tell me Edison Road now. Tell me something else. Let me turn down here because it told me to turn down here. It told me to turn down here and it told me to turn down there. That's crazy. But we did go down here with all the I remember going down here. Remember going down here? Huh? I so remember going this way, but... Nah, the waves is just like... What the hell the waves is doing, like? Right? Now it's telling me to go south down here. You know, now it's telling me... Yeah, the waves is like tripping. Can I go straight, actually? Or I have to turn? I think I could go straight. Yeah, I could go straight. Where is me? Collection, yo. I don't know. It must be the weather. Gas stations all over the place. I don't know their prices, man. I guess we could go straight, so we go go straight. We're going to go straight. Dover. I remember I went to a car show in Dover. Dover, New Jersey. That was interesting. They didn't give no trophies out. They gave out cash price. They gave you back your, your 20 bucks. You paid 20 bucks. Yeah, they go to one of these. So I remember one of these. If they um, if you pay 20 bucks for the car show, you get back 20 bucks. And that's how that went. All right, so we about to get ready actually to pull up. Has nine motions going to point over there to the dealer that we went to last time, so surprisingly it's open. And it is open. I think it's open. It's open or it's closed. Wait a minute. What's going on here? Yeah. It's open. Yeah, it's open. It's open. Alright, so we gonna go in here and see what's popping. So stay tuned. Let me turn that camera back on. Alright, YouTube. So we got another one. Checking this out right here. Um, 2009. As I can see on our dash, checking the light, which is, I guess, as always, um, service shot control. I don't know what that other joint is right here. Look pretty clean, cabin seats, um, 
about to take it for a test drive. We got the TV, which I too much don't care about. But um, it look better than others. It look better than others. But I need to know what this check engine light is about. You know what I mean? Um, pretty, pretty clean, and you know it's pretty, pretty decent. You know what I mean? So we gonna take a test drive in the rain. I came all the way out here in the rain to, you know, to see what it do with this, and I wanna see what it do. You know what I mean? Just go up the block, down the block, come back around. See what I can do. What I can do, do, do. I don't know what I can do. But I'll see what I can do. So stay tuned, you know what I mean? We in the lid act, you know what I mean? I should come outside and show y'all what the light look like. And as, as I should and as I would. You know what I mean? Give y'all a quick glance. So, here it is. Be really cool. And, um, okay, we got a deal of four clothes. And we got a whole screw. Screw, screw, screw. Alright, we gotta go. Alright. Alright, so stay tuned. Alright, so we about to hit the test drive. See how we're feeling. Because at the end of the day, I'm using this for towing, so I need to make sure that it can tow my box Chevy. So we about to make a left on this highway real quick. Go up the road. See, see what it do. I feel a little hesitant, like you need a tune up or something, like you're skipping your mission or something. Am I gonna keep on going straight? Or, okay. Check engine light flashing like crazy. Tracking is shifting decent. Oh, my camera from you, Ella. 
you could point it towards me, that's cool. While I just park, because I can't. Um, yeah, so um, I think it's I think it's not bad. I just gotta find out at the end of the day if that's a um a wobbly tire or because they got a little wobble. That shit is trash. I can't even really see that through that to park for nothing. So won't be using that. But I uh, we'll see. You know, I'm just see what there we could work out. Ain't come all the way out here for nothing, right? This is good right here, right? Alright, All right, so stay tuned. I'll be back with y'all in a minute. Alright, YouTube. So, that didn't quite work out in my favor. But, um, this is starting to get a little bit depressing. You know? It is. Like, you know. I didn't do this in a while, like looking for a vehicle, and it's like, it's like mind blowing. Like, it's it's a lot. Like, so basically, like all these lacks got, you know, what miles they got, check engine light, all of them. So that's a given thing with it. Like, I know, I guess because of the year and the miles, whatever. So that's basically how it's being sold. So I learned something new. You know what I mean? I got my scanner on me, but I didn't put the vehicle on the scanner, which the, um, you know, the, um, the dealer, the owner was very considerate of, you know, very honest guy. You know what I mean? That's why I kind of went back to that um, that spot. So, um, but I don't know. I'm like, I'm not trying to really spend too much on a tow truck. You know what I mean? But then again, it's like, you know, these SUVs running decent is a little costly. So that's the depressing part. Like, you know what I mean? I don't want to buy nothing and have to put a bunch of money into it because that defeats the purpose of everything because, you know, we don't got that much time. I'm, I don't mind, like, you know, you got to service it. You got to do what you got to do with it, which is cool, like, you know what I mean? Because that's what I'm going to do. So, but, um, but, I mean, it was pretty, it was clean. It was clean. It had a little hesitation while riding. I don't know if it was a ram. I couldn't tell exactly what it was, and that was a scary part, you know? It's like I'm driving it and I feel like, I don't know if it's something with the red end or something. Like, you know, it felt, it didn't feel good. Like I drove another one last week and then I didn't feel that. I definitely didn't feel that. So, but it, um, it felt good. Like, you know what I mean? It's for a decent price, but, um, you know, I guess, you know, if it's meant for me, it's meant for me. I leave things in God's hands. Like, that's what I do. You know what I mean? I put out what I put out my energy in the universe and we take it from there. You know what I mean? I make the effort, I make the trip. You know what I mean? And I, and I put it from there. So if something is meant for me, it's meant for me. I'm not even gonna force nothing. And you know, I'm not gonna force that. So as I said, we got an hour and 21 minutes, you know. So I took a chance, I took a risk, and that's what you gotta do. You gotta gamble on yourself, you know what I mean? And if something's for you, it's for you. So I guess this wasn't for me because at the end of the day, I didn't cut a deal, you know? And, and that's what it was. So we're about to hit this sign that say, where are we going? I see Delaware Water down, right? Oh, all right, so we about to hit that sign. I say, New York City! That part ain't feel good. So we about to jump on the 80. We on SR15S, so we about to jump on the 80, heading back to New York City! We got a nice motion on deck. Yeah, Wendy's. Yeah, what you need? He's working, but he's eating. He's on his lunch break, so you know, I'm on deck with the camo, which is all good. It's all good, we got a little hot rod right here, okay. The rain kind of sees down, which is pretty cool, man. So I'm gonna have a quick blow back home. Quick blow back home. So yeah, back to the drawing board again. Back to the drawing board again. So, 
I don't know, I just got, I maybe just wait a little bit longer, you know what I mean? Maybe I, well, we about to hit April anyway, so maybe I'll wait till maybe May or April. Maybe May, April, and see what I see, maybe. I don't know, yeah, I mean, yeah. It's crazy. See, but the thing is, like I'm saying, Regardless what I got, I buy, I gotta put work into it. But what kind of work I gotta put into it? That's, that's the thing, right? So, yeah, I don't know, this is hard. I should have started earlier looking for this joint, you know what I mean? I should have started earlier, but it is what it is. I'm gonna put my best effort and my best foot in, so. All right, I'm gonna head back with y'all after I eat down some of these hours. These minutes, I got an hour and 18, so I'll maybe hit y'all back when I'm like a half an hour, half an hour to home. Um, what we got here? Like, what are you on a race? You on a race? You got that Jetta two point, whatever. Like, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? All right, let me stop playing in the brain because I will make him spin out. I will hit the track button on you, buddy. I will make you spin out. Spin out. What's he doing? He really trying to keep up with me. Should be good. Maybe that brace may be no good. Alright, but I'll get back with y'all. In a minute. Alright, so we still at it. Oh, you know what's funny? Yo, we got the flow. Traffic is good. So I'm not even, I'm not mad about that because it's good traffic. If it was a nice, beautiful day, I'll be in traffic. So I'm just showing y'all the, giving y'all this dope POV. Y'all the flow. Ah, but yeah, I'm about to see. Right mobile too.
say, you know what I mean? I did that gross way, so I don't see why not. Then on top, that's a bourbon. You know what I mean? That's a bourbon. I don't think I want nothing at all like a bourbon. You know what I mean? You know, when you draw with two hands on a salmon, what that mean, right? What that mean, buddy? You got two hands on the stand, well, you shouldn't be driving. You driving with two hands on the stand. That's the people that get into the most accidents. It's too much. So let me see if we're going. Gotta hit the G dub dub. So we're gonna be going east. New York City to George Washington Bridge. I'm just getting this lane. The G dub dub is gonna hit me with the tip. G dub. Yeah, so. show y'all this water flood road god me wish i had a truck look at this water i tell you blood blood man god damn why they can't walk sky pack don't go over here sky pack don't go over here this thing looks crazy it look like a pond on the river oh oh some noise but you know so you want to there and to, I guess I got I messed up on going to the G dub so it kind of like took me off a route and trying to get back on the G dub so when I get back on the G dub people I'll get back to y'all definitely what is that Running through a little town. This is US 46 East, another highway. Uh, not even a highway, this is a highway, but another local town I'm running through because I missed actually kind of got off my route a little bit. The ways just be tripping sometimes. Like, you know what I mean? And then for some reason I got the volume on, but I'm not hearing nothing coming out of the speaker. So I gotta maybe disconnect and reconnect or something because I don't know what's going on there. Let's see, we're the same right here where I gotta go. Alright, so I'll get back to you. Alright, so we on the G-Dog, as y'all can see, lower level. 
So now we gotta get on that Harlem River Drive. So we making we making good time in 38 minutes. 38 minutes and I kept the daylight. I ain't get caught in the dark. I ain't gonna get caught in the dark in the rain anyway, so. So we got so we gotta go to exit two to get on that Harlem River Drive. And I'm glad I'm, I'm underneath the bridge because up top. It's pretty windy and pretty nasty. All right, so we gotta finally get on the G Dub Dub, and we gotta get on that Harlem River Drive, which is coming up in 0 0.5 half a mile. That look like a regular RT. RT Durango or blacked out. Blacked out. He should have blacked out the tail lights. I mean, he should. He should have blacked it all out. Put that toe hitch on it. See you, boy. Maybe tone that old school and all that. I see you, my guy. See you broke your neck real quick. Why not? No, that's a GT. That's not even an RT. That's a GT. Oh, Lambo. You see that Lambo, the yurts? Heard that yours just go by. Then we got the GMC, the Yukon, the SLT. I wonder what the SLT stands for. I don't know, but it looks good though. Good to tow. Good to tow tow. Now traffic building up, which is janky. Got that traffic because everybody trying to. I guess merge onto the same same way that my windows up. The white Yaris is flew by like hello. Alright YouTube, so we gotta get through the the GW and then we go get on that Harlem River Drive and then we gonna jump on that next highway and we gonna figure out, figure out no, they go the Ram truck, Ram Rebel, they go the Ram Rebel Rebel. Okay, we see, we see the Ram Rebel. Got the Ram Rebel on deck. Yeah, so, um, yeah, we are, um, try, try and get some motion here. We getting some motion, you know what I mean? And just go home and get back online and get back on that search and see what I could do. But it, you know, it's kind of hard to go on. You can see things like maybe like one one or two days out the week because I work, you know what I mean? The work, is, my work is in the way, like, because I don't have time after work to to go do something because the hours is dark. And so I only have the one Saturday to actually do this, so. We we'll see what happened next week with that. Like, you know what I mean? If I see anything, and, you know, and drag it wrong real. Maybe I'll run into something. Maybe y'all do. That's why everybody exit, man. That ring is crazy. Oh, come on, man. I don't even see no traffic on my radar. So why everybody moving slow? Like, that's bananas. That is bananas. I don't like how that Ram Rebel look. That's trying to look ugly. It's like he like defeat the purpose of. You said it's got the TRX, dude. Like that joint look ugly. That's an ugly pickup. Bro, just gotta let you know that. That's an ugly, ugly pickup. Look at the view over there. That's what I'm kind of like circling around there, I guess. I guess so, I guess not. I guess, I don't know what happened to Oh, man, I don't know why they be dropping that low. What you got, flat, my guy? I don't know why you even came outside with that ish. Be mad low and they be trying to drive it. Man, you may be hit like such a pothole or something. And just like, I don't know what they be thinking about when they be doing that. The wheels be like bow legged. He may be riding on airbags. 
Nah, God. And then you want to travel on this? Where you going with that? Man, got to be his first car, man. Got to be his first car to do that. Because you can't even enjoy that, man. It looked, got a funny look, but you can't enjoy it. So, all right. But we're going to get back to y'all after we get through this nonsense here. Because we got the whole planet outside. We got trucks and, and everything out here under this G-Dub, man. So, I mean, I, we link back with y'all when we get back on that next highway, you know what I mean? Almost to the spit out. All right, catch y'all in a minute. All right, so we on the Harlem River Drive. As I can see, it's kind of like, damn, it's bad out here. Look at the road. The road is crazy. Crazy rough. Damn, I ain't gonna be driving my old school coming through this. I'm gonna have to look at the map and say Harlem River Drive. Hell no. Damn, and look at the flooding on the road. Oh, whoa, whoa, no. Oh, wow. Whoa. Need a 4x4 four four for this road right here. Where's it telling me to go now? It's telling me to go on the park. In 2.5 miles. Ha. Take exit 17. You work. After I did the whole RFP trip, you ain't want to work. Now you want to speak. Central Shut Central up. Central. Ways is crazy. I ain't want to speak all through my trip, and now I want to speak because I'm in motion. No man, give y'all some light here because I'm in motion. Yeah, so um, yeah, just get the. I guess that's the Harlem River. <laughs> that's the river. You see the river? That's the Harlem River. Man. Let me give y'all a little bit close up of the river. Imagine you guys are swimming that river. Yeah, that's a hall, that old ass bridge. Look at that old bridge. What bridge is that? Can't even identify that bridge. That's an old bridge, boy. I wonder what bridge crosses. Crosses that. I can't even see it on my own my ways. That's an old ass bridge, though. Surprised they didn't knock that joint down. Sheesh. I gotta Google what bridge is that. They got a bunch of bridges, actually. Rocking us Expressway, Grand Central Parkway. That's where we go. I wonder what projects is that? What projects is that? What buildings is that? They're complexes, not even I'm saying projects, but they may be turned it into a project, but it's a complex. I wonder what bridge is that? So we over here, exit 22 West, 140 News We blowing through Harlem. Harlem! Grazing through the Harlem. So we got a few places to go. Let me see, let me share. So traffic is moving. That's good. Good, 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 good. All right, so we're we'll gonna get back to y'all again. You know what I mean? Just wanted to show y'all the motion, just kind of give y'all a little bit of everything that's going on with me, you know? Do the um, do the POV. And what is that? What the hell is that? Cosmos, what is that? What the hell is that? I don't know, it's a bridge again. They got a lot of crazy retarded, like, ornaments, ornaments, stuff out here. Like, it's a little crazy. Oh, oh, this uh, Let me see what it's telling me. 17. So I still got a ways to go. 19. Make sure we get on 17. They got this building here. I don't know what building is that. They got another old ass bridge. Now they got all these old ass bridges. They may be actually charging for this bridge. So there we got to There we go. RFK 17. Y'all charging to get on there. Seven hours and all that. Oh, in 1,000 feet, use the right lane to exit right. So we gotta, we gotta know that. No God tell me that. I don't know what bridge is that. But we're getting on the R RFK. Exit right to exit 17, I-278, RFK Bridge RFK. for Bruckner Expressway, Grand yeah, Central yeah, Parkway. Yeah, yeah, so we on the RFK. Okay, 
Bay, you know, going under some bridge, which I don't know what the hell bridge is at. Swiggling around. Look at that tank. What the hell is under there? It got sand. Look at how they be making them bubbles for the snow. And we didn't even get that much snow. That's crazy. They made that. Hey, that's crazy. That's all sand, yo. Salt sand, whatever. They made a bubble. I'm starting to see these all over the place, man. New York City not playing, man. They ain't not playing when there's snow, but we not getting that much snow no more, so don't know what to tell y'all. And this old ass bridge right here is the RFK Bridge. This bridge being in a quarter of a mile. 19. Use the right two lanes to exit to I-278 West toward Queens Airports. Yeah. Watch out, hazard reported ahead. Hazard, what the hell hazard is that? And there go the toe. There go the money. You see where the money at? Bloop, 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 bloop. Thousand exit cameras right to the muzzle. I-278 West toward Took Queens the money. Airports. All right, so we got some motion. So we on the Grand Central, Royal Central Parkway. We got Queens Airport. That's the Guardia, if y'all don't know. That's the Guardia Airport. And Hazard and Road. I don't see the Hazard, but something coming up. I wonder what it is. Maybe it could be a skunk. Maybe it could be a tire. You got the big tow truck there. Got the big tow truck. Oh, car, something happened. Back into the wall tire. Look at that. That's what I've been seeing a lot. Around the people popping their tires and all that. So. Alright, so we got some staking. In 1.5 miles. Stay to the left. I-278 West Grand, Grand Central Grand Parkway. Island. I've never been to Randall's Island. Rand that's, I guess that's Random Island. That's crazy, right? That's like an island. I want to go to Random Island. Anybody been to Random Island before? I don't recall me ever going to Random Island. I got to do Random Island. I got to do Random Island for tourists. I want to know what the hell Random Island got. I got to do that this summer. I'm putting that in the bucket list, people. Randall's Island. You know I want to do the Statue of Liberty. Do the Statue of Liberty even still exist? I don't want to know. You know what I mean? I, thought, I think I heard something like they try to take it down or do something with it, but I don't know, rebuild it or something. Or move it. I think they wanted to move it. Something I heard. I don't know. So. I don't know, but. Yeah, this summer, I'm going to do Randall's Island. Randall's Island. I remember I said that. Randall's Island. I'm gonna do that. And this, I guess this is the official, um, uh, okay. I don't know what the hell that other bridge was. I don't know if it was like the park or something, something. I don't know what it was, but this is the RFK bridge. That, I guess it don't really light up. Yo, you know the best bridge, the best bridge I seen was the Koski Osco bridge. Yo, Google Koski Osco bridge. It's a bridge like this, but you know what? They put all these neon lights and it look crazy at night, man. Especially like if you got a dope car, a motorcycle, whatever, and you breeze through that with a GoPro or something. Oh God, man, your footage is gonna be crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. It will be crazy, so. All right, coming off that bridge. We're not quite off there, but. In 1,000 feet, use the left three lanes to stay to the left. All right, I will. Time. We got 22, 22 minutes. Stay to the left to I-278 West Grand Central Parkway. What's our web? We're starting to see some brake lights, some tail lights. Mm, they look like it's a big truck on the way. Damn, another toll. Oh, man, that's on the other side. I was about to get mad. I was about to say, y'all flashing me again, homie. I was say, hell no. Hell no, you ain't doing In that. half a mile, use the left three lanes to stay to yeah. the left to Grand Central Park Way East yeah, know, LaGuardia I know, Airport. I know, I know, I know. Watch out, hazard reported That's ahead. Oh, shoot, what hazard? Got all the dirt and all that, but what hazard got talking? 
What hazard are y'all talking about? Tesla. I've never been in a Tesla. You know what? One day I gotta sit in a Tesla. You think I'll be cool in a Tesla? What's the matter? Should I get rid of the scat pack for Tesla? What you think? Huh? You don't know? You have to be in a test drive and then you maybe go say, hey, you go. Um, Tesla's electric. It don't make no sound, but it's all like, you know. I don't know. Could you deal with not hearing the noise? Silent mode, huh? Loud it. I don't know. I want to do an upgrade one day, man. I want to do. I was looking at the um the CT the um the Cadillac um what is In it the 1, C, CT5 Blackway. Yo, I like how they looking. I like how they looking, but I don't want no brand new car getting like that. Like, but I like how they looking. The black wings looking crazy. I gotta be investment. Maybe one of YouTube channel get to the Stay time the and we get a CT5 black wing. You know what I mean? That would be dope as hell. You know what I mean? Cause they got like something like 600 horses, fully loaded, luxury out. It's crazy. You know what I mean? It is crazy. But um, in 2.9 miles, I think they had a special one. Stay to the left too, to Grand right? Central Parkway East. All right, you know what, man? Enough for you. When I needed you, I needed you. I don't need you no more. You don't gotta talk no more. You're a dismissed. Yeah, but um, yeah, they had a special on Teslas and all that. I think they were doing like ten grand off on the home. Um, the ones where the doors go up with the home, um, they look like the wing. The little, they look like vans or jeeps or whatever. I've seen a lot of people getting that. But um, I've never been in a Tesla. And one day, you know what we gonna do? We're gonna go to a Tesla dealer and we're gonna go and look at the Teslas. That's what we're gonna do. We gotta put that in the bucket list. Because I'm curious. I know a few people with Tesla, but I never like begged them, like, yo, let me see in your Tesla. Like, nah, let me get. Nah. Like, you know what I'm saying? I wanna go to the dealer and I wanna own. I wanna sit in it just to see what, you know, what it is. Like, you know what I, mean? I don't know. Maybe I like it. You know what I mean? I may like it. And that's what I fear. I may like it. And if I like it, I'm gonna get it. You know? So, but you know, Tesla is the future. You know, everybody doing the Tesla radios, which is pretty dope. You know what I mean? I may do a radio, a radio swap in the box Chevy and then um, in the Honda Accord or something. Just kind of upgrade them radios, like t Tesla radios and them big factory radios where you could kind of like, you know, get all your, your Apple CarPlay and all that. You know what I mean? Just upgrade. I was thinking about upgrading, yeah, definitely. But, um, yeah, we looking good, we looking good, man. We made good time. We got 18 minutes before we go um, we touch down, and yeah, which is good. So I'm making perfect, perfect time right now. Um, in the bad weather, that's crazy. Like, you know what I mean? With the bad weather, you thought, I thought I'd be like jammed up in traffic. I had to be like two and a half hours deep on the Jersey. You know what I mean? Made it in Jersey in the hour and 20 minutes. You know what I mean? Was it worth it? I think it was. I think it was, but as I said, it didn't really work out 100% in my favor. It could work out in my favor. I may have to uh, break a neck in a little bit, but as I said, um, it just uh, uh, a few concerns about that Jeep is. I mean, I was driving it, got it needs a tune up point blank because I could feel I could feel the hesitation on it, which you know what I mean it's cool, but something in the rear. And I need this for towing. So something in the red was kind of wobbling. I don't know if it was a tire or I don't know if it's something with the, I don't know. I couldn't really tell, but they had a little, a little wobble, like, you know what I mean? And I drove a couple of lakhs and I didn't feel that. I don't know if the diff oil is dry. Like, you know, that's just, that's just like a bunch of things. Like when I get this home, when I get the tow truck, you know what I mean? I gotta check the diff oil. I gotta make sure everything, I make sure the diff cover off and, you know, just do, you know, do do my checks and all that, my, my maintenance on it. So, definitely, you know what I mean, then I looked in the hood, damn, I didn't even record the hood, which I should have, I think I did, I'm not even sure if I remember I, I recorded in the engine, engine bay, I don't think so. But I seen like some wiring from the harness, like loose, like something was going on there, like I don't know what was going on, but, 
it looked like something was going on with the harness and the wiring or something. Like, I'm not sure. But basically, like, that's the main thing. Like, everything worked in it. You know what I mean? I think the rear trunk door, um, you know, they're supposed to be automatic, right? And um, it wasn't, like, I guess something with the, um, the motor or something. It wasn't going up on its own and closing on its own. Um, the wipers worked. The heat worked. You know, it was it kept it clean though. Whoever had it, the seats was it busted up, and that's another major thing. The interior, like you know, what I mean, busted up interior. The interior wasn't busted up, and they kind of kept it clean. I guess that's what they do. They keep it clean and keep the battery charged and all that, rather than some of these people. You go look at the car, and they got a dead battery for like they had sitting in there for years, and they expect you to like buy this shit. Like, you know what I mean? If you got a dead battery. You can't even start it and they want you to like, oh yeah, it's for sale. Oh, and another thing, I don't got no title. Like what? Like that's crazy, you know what I mean? And they don't got no title, you know what I mean? So I, I you know, that's just like bananas. So, as I said, it was kind of a, uh, it was, you know, it was a uh, experience, it was a journey. So, what else, what else I got on? Um, what else I can say about that vehicle? Um, um, it was different. The rims was different. You know how the the, um, the regular Escalade kind of kind of like got, they got them star rims. So I don't know what model that was because I know it's different models. Um, um, they come out with like luxury models, whatever. So I'm not. I didn't really do too much homework on that particular vehicle, but um, the rims was different. The rims was different in terms of, I don't know if it was a, um, one of the platinum models, because some of the platinum models, you know, the rims come different from the regular standards. So I don't know if that was a platinum joint, but I, I mean, all the necessary thing works, the wipers, whatever, whatever, I've seen that, but you know, just to check engine light on the dash now and whatever, you know how that goes. So, um, I said I would just walk with my scanner, but he told me he have a scanner, whatever, but you know, I always got scanner on deck. You know what I mean? So the last car should I actually put it on the scanner, but I forgot. You know what I mean? Cause I ain't even come in the scan. I came in a Toyota, so that that was my fault on forgetting the scanner. But I could have recorded, you know, we're doing you know, record the car on the scanner, but I didn't want to go as far as doing that because you know, um the negotiation wasn't, you know, you know, the, the seller was at basically set price, whatever it's gonna be, that's it, you know what I mean? No markdown, no breakdown, and I respect that, like, you know what I'm saying? I respect that, like, you know what I mean? So, I didn't want to go as far as, you know, putting it on the scanner, because I know I wasn't really gonna get it, so it wasn't All right, so, I had to clear up some space on the, um, the SD card because it got full. But that, yeah, I gotta go back and actually clear up some previous videos. But yeah, as I was saying, um, I don't remember what I was saying, but you know, um, yeah, about the on um, the truck. So um, yeah, as I said, I don't know. It, you know, I be second guessing and wondering, like, you know, damn, like, should I went in a little bit deeper into you know the vehicle? Like, should I, you know? Because as I said, man, it was um, it it was it don't I ain't see no leaks or nothing like that. So that was just kind of like one thing like out the way. Like you know, I don't see no leaks. It's just the regular stuff. I didn't see no um airbag like, but it had like a crack on the dash. Like I don't know what the hell. It's always something on the dash with these cars. Like I don't know what the hell people be doing. You know what I mean? But um, yeah. Um, I guess the check engine light was just something that you know. Because we gotta get a New York State inspection, so you know you gotta check engine light. You gotta make sure you fix that. Like, depending on what that is. Um, but yeah, as I said, the only thing that really kind of just kind of like turned me off was that hesitation in the the wheel. Like I got a YouTube that I gotta go on Google and see what it is. The red. That could be something maybe with the red end or something like that. Like you know what I mean. And you don't want those problems because as I said, at the end of the day, we're using it for towing, so we don't want no rear hand problem you gotta make sure the rear hand fluid it maybe need goddamn fluid maybe have no fluid in it damn pumpkin maybe dry you know what i mean so that's maybe damn near what it was so 
don't know. Um, I don't know. As I said, man, if something's meant for me, remember that. If something's meant for me or something's meant for you, God will make it happen. God will present itself or present it to you. You don't have to do too much and worrying about it, you know what I mean? He sees what we do, he sees what we want, and if he's gonna bless you with something, he's gonna bless you with something. So as I said, I did my due diligence and I'll be back on the search. And as I said, if that's meant for me, it will be waiting for me, point blank. You know what I'm saying? They'll be waiting for me next week or something like that. You know what I mean? So, um, the, um, the dealer actually said, you know what I mean? I guess if it don't move, I mean, he's gonna, um, He's gonna send it to the auction. You understand what I'm saying? Kinda look, should I look in the auction? I'm sure I was thinking about that. Like, you know what I mean? Look in the auction and see, maybe grab something from the auction or something like that. You know what I mean? I was kinda like thinking about that too, cause that's where them dealers actually getting. That's where they getting these vehicles and putting a lot, getting it from the auction. You know what I mean? They had this thing called Cold Park, whatever, but um, I don't know about that auction was kinda weird because, um. You know, so I'm, I'm gonna look again tonight also on there because you know, you're basically you bidding whatever. So I don't know, I may look at something, I may bid on something because at the end of the day, it's like you go to the deal, it's like the same ish. Like, you understand what I'm saying? It's like, that's basically where they're getting it from. Like, you know what I mean? They're getting it from these places and, and you know, but you know, us regular people, we want to go to the dealers and whatever, whatever. We don't want to bid because a lot of times you maybe don't know, but um, yeah, I may, I may check it out. I may, I may go another route, people. I may, I may look at some child a bit on it and see what it is. You know what I'm saying? I may do that. So I'm on, uh, I'm gonna go online tonight and um, yeah, I don't know. Maybe shut up our account and maybe the bid. I don't know. We'll see who got an account. Somebody got an account. I mean, maybe I could bid on their account. So. Now nah, well, I'd rather get my own account if I'm ready to go bid. So I'll figure that out. All right, but we gonna wrap up this video. You know what I mean? I just took y'all on the dopest POV ever in the Dow Charger Scat Pack, in the storm, in a hurricane. We went through a tornado and all that. And now the rain stopped and we back. And back on the ground again. Tomorrow the weather should should be better. Will the box set me come outside tomorrow? I don't think so because I told you I was cutting those POVs, man. I told you I was cutting out POVs, but we will do a cold start on it and do a walk around you know, and move it around. Regular stuff, like you no, know, I mean keep it going. You know? So, alright YouTube. If you're new to my channel, like for Mike LS, look at the back end videos. Hit that like button. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. You know what I mean? Please, thank you for watching. And we take it into the top. We catch you on the next video.